me, Mr. Kaisler. What's going on, guys? It's Mr. Kaisler here, and today we're going to be covering what you can get from the darts game and actually how you get a perfect score in it. Very simple stuff. I thought it was going to be a lot harder than it actually was. Um, the goal of the game is to get on top of the leaderboard, but the main goal of the game is you go from 300 points and you got to get down to zero. So how it's going to work is you're going to want to throw, uh, for the best score, a perfect score, you're going to want to throw five 50s, which I just thrown a 50 there. You don't have to get a perfect bullseye. You just have to get on the green or on the red, and you'll get a 50 every single time. But you'll throw five 50s, and then right below that, you'll see a green 17, two green 17s right there. Um, but the one you're going to want to get is the one on the inside. I it's been a long time since i've actually played darts and i kind of forget how it works but i think you get triple points for the green 17 but as you can see very simple uh, way to play it you just have to wait for the circle to basically get as small as you can before you decide to throw the dart and it is a little hard to aim see i just missed my perfect score there i'll show you actually here in a second on how to get a perfect score it is kind of nice um, when you do get close to uh, zero, it will tell you what uh, section you need to throw it in, and it'll do a little cut scene there, and you'll finish the game. So let's go on. Uh, see, I got seven dart throws there. So I got on the top of the leaderboards. I got a heavenly dart player. Um, but now we're going to show you the perfect game I get. So now we're down to 100 points again. I get really lucky there at the dart throw and get a, another bullseye. And then I actually nail my 17, which is a perfect score. And that is six, yep, it is triple points, like I said before. And that is six darts thrown. And as far as I know, that's the per best score you can possibly get in this game. Um, I don't think it really matters. I think all you need to do is get uh, seven to get the luck up material, which I'm going to show you actually right now. So whenever you approach Wedge after you get the number one spot in the leaderboard, he gives you the materia, the luck up materia. Um, I'm not sure, depending on where you're at in the game. I don't want to give any spoilers away. <laughs> uh, but uh, yeah, I would just think that anytime you get number one, whenever that is for, you know, you decide to get number one on darts, you, uh, and then you approach him, he will give you that materia. And also the material is purple from what I remember. It was yellow in the old one. So that kind of threw me off for a little bit because I was looking for it. But it has five levels. And I, in my opinion, it, it can be very beneficial later on. But I hope this guy's helped you out. Be sure to catch me on uh, Twitch from uh, on Wednesdays and Saturdays from 8 a.m. to 2 p.m. Central Time. Uh, you can catch me over there, but I plan on making more videos like this. And if this guide help you, helped you, be sure to leave a comment down below. Subscribe to the channel. Hit the notification bell for more content just like this. And I hope you guys have a great night, great day, and I'll catch you guys on the next one.